I don't know. Maybe he just wanted the guarantee to warp on the high ground. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright guys, I am to live and die. I'm being joined by three co-catchers. Agent Vitality. What's up? Marine King. How's it going? And AG Defunk. What's going on, guys? Spawning in the top left corner, we have the red pair. <laughs> RDG Ock. No. And down in the bottom right, we have the purple protoss known as Void. This is game three of the semifinals. Just check some. Away. If you check some mi mineral line APM, these two got it going on as far as their keyboard is going. I don't know okay. what in the world these two are doing. Getting them fingers warmed up and. Oh yeah. Ready to throw down some pipe. Right you know what's funny? I actually, I actually remember Void from Plat and Under. I, I think I ran into him a couple of times. Elvis Masters. Yeah, I know. So is Pop Tart. I. And you're I still obviously. Playing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I I wish I could play like all like practice and hopefully uh, pr get promoted, but. Terrible timing. I can't do it. Yeah, Pop Tart was giving me crap about it, and uh, I was too, bro. Did you see me? I was like, yeah. Oh, you're bad. <laughs> Yo, you said I was silver, silver and hot. <laughs> Same <Silver> thing. Hot. <laughs> hot is easier. No, it isn't. Yeah, it is. So hopefully, we see some early tanks come out from Magna. He did that as gas down, but uh, that could mean a lot of things at this point in the game. Sure. Yes, yes, yes. Looks like Agnes slowing down because he realized he's Terran and he does not need to spam. <laughs> <laughs> Saturating that gas. Go ahead and block that probe in there and uh, get the first work kill of the day. <laughs> And Agna doesn't even look like he's gonna scout. Maybe he'll scout with this Marine after he uh, takes down the scouting pro. Not too sure about what he plans. We saw this the, the other night. Agna did not scout uh, for a long time. Yes, because Protoss only can only do one thing. <laughs> Agna doesn't really play standard <laughs> from the last games we've watched him play. Are we gonna see a factory? Yes. Yes, we do. Wasn't Ogna the one that did all those cheesy builds? Uh, yeah, last game we seen, or I watched him play. Yeah, he played Bonkers and he did, and he did almost an all-in with his SCVs, and they end up pulling his SCVs back and losing. And then he do like a double reactor Hellion or something. Oh, look at that! As you speak of it, there you, here goes the reactor. Awesome! Awesome! Metagames that. He's getting his supply up. Making sure he's got plenty of supply to work with when he's double pumping these aliens. Indeed. Yeah. Well, I don't know. It's still, it's still iffy. Doing a little dance with that SCB there. Oh, yeah. That SCB is. Meanwhile, uh, we got a zealot and a stalker. Rushing up to see what's going on at the air. Uh, nothing too interesting. Oh, this is gonna be a drop. Actually. Oh, you better raise that wall. Oh, yeah. why did he back up? He could have <laughs> died and probably have died, but it was his he opinion. Scouted and doesn't see the factory or the starport. Just the really reactor. Taking barracks. It's at least second down. He's trying to uh, get that natural online. Ogna does enjoy his one base plays. Yep. And there is that medevac for that drop. It's going to be. Yep, wow, there, goes the th again. there goes the 3 gate robo from the Protoss. Oh, it's going to be an elevator, I think. Me thinks. Is he going to have blue flames or is he going to stick with ghetto flames? Uh, <laughs> we don't know. I believe yeah. it's gonna Wait, it's... be the ghetto flame for this one, but mm -hmm. as you can see by Void's wall, I think he might be a little worried. He's got his stalkers on hold position right there, just in case he tries to slip a hellion or two in, and they're probably gonna run right into that wall. 
think he's going to... Avoid that do. wall. He has the medevac. Now, and he's going to do a drop with marines, but what is he going to do with these hellions? He can't get... He he's going to try to rush in the, the expo. Oh, jeez. Try to Bro, pull, what are you doing? Stop. Pull some stalkers <laughs> out. Stop probes. What are you Stop doing? Probes. You're drunk. Oh. Go home. And, and he's already oh. got a nice eight workers killed, so... But those stalkers that Void had in the back of the base are not there anymore, and this drop might actually hit... Nope. Oops. Oh. Okay. Uh, 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 oh, he's pulling yeah, yeah. yes. he's pulling him away. Drop. That moving drop, you know he's pro. There we go. How many? Nine, ten. Ten workers killed. So many workers oh, killed. Oh, oh really? Back to Hellion, move in. Oh. And at this point, oh, you should have. Oh my gosh, and the Medivac Hellions are so out of position. Oh, here comes the Hellions. 17 oh, no. workers killed. Ooh. 17 workers killed, but... Yeah, he's got the units. Oh, it's actually pretty home. close. He's got his raven up. Oh, and cleans Horrible up that eye. Very simply running straight into the ravens and the marines. Yeah, it looks like Augment's just gonna stay on one base and... Oversaturate uh, that one base. Yep. Go for tank bench. <laughs> yeah. And he's still producing more SCVs. Harvester tab, yeah, he is way ahead, only on one base. So, so. And there's that tank. He would. I think he's looking to pull pull some of those SCVs. He's just oversaturating until he goes in. He's probably going to bring seven or eight with him. So that's my guess, is from what I've seen by Ogno play. Banshee, oh, and another Banshee going down. Another observer, or another observer going in. Uh, just at the rim, so he's gonna see when Agna pushes out, and that's a it. Oh my gosh! I sure called that one. Another all in. What do you know? Yeah. How about that? Well, I mean, that's all, two, all in. two games in a row, two all ins. Hmm. This he's isn't still, completely all in. Yeah, actually, he has pretty good he's saturation. He's still pretty saturated. Not really. He's not really that saturated at all. It's 23 probes for each base, and he has like 16. And here he goes. Oh, jeez. He can just siege up. Literally just siege up. Sieged him, tank siege. Oh. Thanks. Nah. That immortals, he's gonna need to pump out some more immortals if he wants to get. Yeah, there he goes, Chrono boosting the third one out. And. The Terran has a uh, decent supply lead. And he's still producing more guys. Yeah. Oh this, no! Ooh. Uh, uh, nice uh. siege hits, but not gonna do much. It's like he's just gonna. Oh, I nice don't know. Siege tank hit. Uh, <laughs> it's the bunker. <laughs> the bunker is going down for Agna. Uh, at this and point, if I was Void, I would be uh, walking to the Terran's base. Yeah, at I was. Point, point, if I were Agna, I would start building a manor CC and say GG. Just it's because he really has up in the bag. Oh, and like, by both sides. Just and actually, so much precious time. Tanks are going yeah, down. It's gonna be an early GG. Tanks are going down, but everything else is still alive. So many Marines, SCVs attacking. The immortals are sitting there. Don't know what to do. Go confused as anything. And he survives. G GBG. GBG. Good. <laughs> and that's what I like to see, a Terran win. Good bitch in game. <laughs>